build your first WhatsApp automation in under five minutes together with us. In this video, we will show you how to utilize Super Chat in the combination with WhatsApp Business to build complete automations, kind of chatbots in under five minutes. And I would say, Maurizio, let's go. Yeah. I think what's important before we start is the question, okay, what do I actually need mm -hmm. to start my very first WhatsApp automation? Can you guide me through that? Quickly? Yeah, for sure. So we will need a super chat account with the WhatsApp business API slash WhatsApp business account connected. This takes five minutes. We have a lot of guides for that and we can even help you with setting up super chat the correct way. So you're ready. So if we have this, we just need to click on automations on top and I would say, with this, we kind of jump into the software. As we can see it here, this is the automation feature. We click on new automation and we are ready to start. Yeah, very, very first part before starting the automation is the question, what is triggering the automation? So what mm -hmm. is the first point? In this case, we choose new incoming conversation. That means the very first time a customer is contacting you, it will open a new conversation and we're gonna answer with a little message. In this case, we just make it very, very simple. It's just on a question like, how can we help you? Three buttons, A, B, C, mm -hmm. and that's it. Okay, so this is called a quick reply, right? And we could set this up to kind of qualify incoming messages, right? Um, what happens if I click on A um, yeah. as a customer? Yeah, let's quickly jump in how it looks from mm -hmm. the customer view. So this is the WhatsApp message. You write, hello, let's say like mm -hmm. the very first time you're contacting us, mm -hmm. the automatic reply goes in and asks you like, how can we help you? A, B, C, mm -hmm. you click on A. Understood. And okay. now we jump back to Super Chat. What's gonna happen next? Uh -huh. You see it here, we have the three buttons. If I use the little dot on A, I can move it to the right and now we see all the options we have. Mm -hmm. For example, what I would say, like we just answer you and mm -hmm. tell you like, hey Jonas, thank you very much for your message. Mm -hmm. How can we help you with A? Mm -hmm. Okay, so we can build paths. Like if I'm clicking on A, we could continue the conversation from here and build a flow that only comes if I clicked on A as a WhatsApp and customer uh, as a reply to your first message. Yeah. Okay. Next step then, for example, let's mm -hmm. say we want to automate if I click on B. Yeah. If you click on B in yeah. this case. So we choose the little button B, the little dot, move it to the right, and then we have a lot of options here. Mm -hmm. So one of my favorite ones is, for example, the label option. Mm -hmm. So let's say, like, okay, we want to find all the label, like all the conversations with the label B, or mm -hmm. like which happen B, mm -hmm. like in the chat. Yeah. We just use it. We add the label B, and afterwards we will find all of these okay. conversations. Understood. Um, let's imagine I clicked on C as last example um, and this is the option that I want to talk to a human because this automation chatbot annoys me. Is there an option to kind of take this chat and move it instantly to a human? Yeah, yeah. We just use it, you click on C and then you see here like we can actually assign it to a human. Okay. So what I would do in this case would be like, okay, I assign it to like my support agent, Mika in this case, mm -hmm. and then we answer the client of course because he has to know okay we assigned it to someone yeah which just answers it like hey Jonas no worries we're gonna take over Mika is gonna take over actually just give him like five to ten minutes and you will have the message in your pocket nice. in WhatsApp okay perfect um, that was a really nice concise overview Mauricio thank you really much um, I think right now kind of your task is to get creative we discussed a really high level use case here with A, B and C let's be honest um, Maybe you can just guide us through some real life examples in a way. How are businesses currently utilizing SuperChat? Yeah. I mean, in the support use case, for example, they use A, B, C for, okay, A is I have a problem. B is, okay, my WhatsApp, for example, doesn't yeah. work anymore. Yeah. Or C is I want to talk to a human. Okay. One way. Mm -hmm. Other question could be like in recruiting use case is mm -hmm. like, okay, we ask them questions like, yeah. okay, do you want to apply for a sales manager position? Mm -hmm. Do you want to apply for a customer success position mm -hmm. or any other position? Yeah. So A, B, and C would be sales manager, customer success, and other. Okay, nice. We could also utilize this for marketing to segment WhatsApp newsletter subscribers or for sales to kind of qualify and route incoming new messages. Yeah. Mm. Maurizio, what are kind of the next steps? So, the viewer saw the video, is kind of amazed by Super Chat, wants to start um, to build his first own automations. What are the next steps? Yeah. I think it's very, very simple. You just go to superchat.com. Mm -hmm. We have two options. 
Just create your own account, set up WhatsApp with a few videos in a few minutes. Mm -hmm. If you get stuck, we have a live chat. It's going to support you setting nice. up the WhatsApp number. Or you say, okay, I'm not completely sure if I, how can I use mm -hmm. it? Like, is it something for my business? Yeah. No problem. You can talk to one of our sales managers. They're going to explain you like how the super chat work, how do we proceed? And then you just book an appointment okay. and we continue from there. Sounds like a plan. Then I would say happy building for your first WhatsApp automation.